Mr. Specs, tell me what exactly happened. We were paying our respects. Um, about 30 or 40 people were um, placing flowers, signing the wall, and then a car drove by and uh, started shooting. And uh, uh, one guy was hit, Bird, uh, Kenneth, his mom is here. He got shot in the inner thigh. Uh, Frank Gotti was also here. Uh, and we all help, helped him up and uh, got him into the car. We called 911, tried to get the ambulance here. He was bleeding real badly. So uh, he, uh, he, he got into another vehicle and somebody just drove him to Methodist University as fast as they can. And then this crime scene tape went up. And yeah, and then the, it, it became a crime scene all over again. A whole nother shooting, a whole different day. And then the officers came by, they found one shell casing in the, uh, in, uh, in the street. Uh, there was another shot that uh, blew out the tires um, to this SUV. So, uh, uh, yeah, it was uh, maybe two or three shots fired, uh, and everybody, man, just scattered and hit the ground. And now they can't even get up there now to place the flower? And now, yeah, they blocked it off, they blocked off the whole scene. It's become another crime scene all over again. And, um, and um, they expanded to Family Dollar, but it was actually you know, in between this building and Family Dollar. And what do you think about that happening a day after the shooting? I, I, uh, I, I think it was really, you know, um, just, just, it got everybody shook up. And, uh, and a lot of these people don't even know, you know what I'm saying, uh, or what's going on or why. So it was a lot of pe innocent people up here. Okay, thank you, Tommy, so much for sharing with no us what exactly happened. Um, as we said, the police tape is now up. Police here on the scene investigating.